don't know about you, but I have had a lot of uncertainty these days, and I think a lot of Americans can relate to me on that one. You come into work, you're not sure what email is going to come out that will totally derail your day. And for me, uncertainty is very unsettling. So I have had to go back to engineering principles and standards to get some certainty in this crazy world we live in today. So I've developed a method based on the laws of thermodynamics, which applies to all organisms, to help you to get some certainty into your life. The first law is, energy is neither created nor destroyed, it only changes form. How does that help you with uncertainty? It helps you because you only have so many forms of energy that you can input on a daily basis. You got food, you've got water, you've got breath. These are all forms of energy. All of these forms of energy are neither created nor destroyed. They only change form. Well, when you put in good energy, you're gonna get out good energy. When you wake up in the morning, you need to have one thing sorted, and that's your battery. You need it to be 100% charged. You make sleep a priority. You have a consistent sleep and wake cycle. No cell phone an hour before bedtime, no scrolling, have a nice, decent routine to help you wind down and ease into sleep. Now, if you wake up and your battery is 100% fully charged, I can guarantee you that you're gonna be able to cope with all the chaos coming in much better than if you were sleep deprived and your brain was foggy and you were wired energy in equals energy out. And this is the quality energy in equals quality energy out. There's two forms here where you can get energy in with yourself. That's in your body and that's in your mind. You all know what a quality input looks like for body energy. You know that you need to eat your vegetables and your fruits. Variety is key. These things are just not something your grandmother may have told you. Now the second input that you have is your mind. You really have to be intentional about what you feed your mind as well. The news can be very negative. Bound the time you spend watching the news for a healthy mind. First law of thermodynamics? Yes, it really does help with uncertain times. Oh, hey, sorry about that. I got a call, I gotta cut this short, but please stay tuned for my next short because I will reveal the second law of thermodynamics. It will blow your mind. It will reframe the way you think about what you do in your day job. And it will help you combat uncertainty in a way that you never realize. We'll uncover the three laws of thermodynamics one short at a time. And please don't forget to subscribe.